All right, we are on to our final map, which is a pressure change map. We just finished doing air pressure, and so we recorded all the different air pressures and how they are different compared with the other areas. But the air pressure map is looking at over time. So how much has the pressure changed over time? And so they'll have varying amounts about when, how long it was. So these lines that we're going to be drawing are called isalobars. Sounds like salad bars, but no, it's isalobars, and that's the connecting the area of change. So we're looking at how much has the pressure actually changed. Before there were numbers like 10, 16, 10, 12. So how many points up or down have, has it moved? So I'm going to begin with my black pen, because I'm going to click connect everywhere that was zero. So let's get all those zeros taken care of. So I see one random zero out here in California. We're going to actually just pretend that that zero is part of something out here in the Pacific. All right, so let's see. I see zeros through kind of the Rocky Mountains. Oh, they go out this way. Hmm, okay, let's connect over here. So do 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 do. Let's make it kind of a squiggle. Zero zero zero. Where do I go from here? Well, I am going to connect up around through the southeast of the United States, but where do I go? It's the question. I see positive numbers, and then I see negative numbers. So based on what I know zeros need to be between positive and negative. Okay, so let's see. Here's a negative. That's a positive. So zero is going to have to be closer there. So I'm going between positive and negative. That's positive. That's negative. Positive, negative. I'll have to go right through the tip of Kentucky up to those zeros. So let's go. Do, 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 do. Positive, negative. Positive, negative. Oh, I'll go up to Indiana and across and over to Maine. That's kind of a weird, bumpy thing. So let's call all those zeros. Okay. So I've got all the positives all grouped together in the Midwest. And these are all negatives down here in the uh, Southeast. So let's connect up. What should we do first? Let's do our positives. Where has the pressure increased? So if pressure is increasing. If we're getting high pressure, that does mean it's colder. That means it's blue. That's that cold air from Canada. That's the high, that's like the continental polar air. So this cold air has come down. So let's see. I see a six, five. Well, these are kind of like mushed all together. Hmm. Well, we have to go in order. That is the trick with this part. So let's start with twos. So this two. I'm going to count from 0 to 2. So here's 0. There must be 1 there. We'll do 1s later. Here's 2. So this is where you need a really skinny pen. So with blue, 2 and 2. Uh, let's see. That's a 2, then 3, then 5. Uh-oh. So down here, I need to get to this 2. But there's a 5 in the way. I can't count 2, 5, 2. So I actually need to go really kind of close to that 0 down there so I can get to that 2. And then all the way around, because if you read zero, you had to count one, two, three, four, five to get to five. So this line of twos needs to go pretty darn close all the way around. Interesting. Uh oh. Some of you might start to see, uh oh. How about that one? That one has to be between this line that was two and zero. So positive one, because you have to count one, two, zero, one, two. So here we go. Really skinny. Try not to let your lines cross. Try not to let your lines cross. It gets very close together, and there's our ones. Wow, phew. Look at how that's really, really close. My goodness. Okay, so after two comes three. Okay, so I see two threes here. Three and three. Uh oh, there's a five. I don't count. Three needs to be between two and five. So three has to go in between there. Three. Three, 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 three. Uh oh, same thing between the three and the five. No, don't touch the five. Don't touch the five. Three. They didn't even put a four on here. That'd be too close. Oh my goodness. All right, so now let's do the five. Let's just do the five. Five. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. So that inner area is going to be a six. Maybe I'll just kind of draw a blob in that area. Wow. So that means that, so out here in the Midwest and the Rockies, there's not much change. But as you get going through this corner of Arizona and Tennessee and Kentucky, there is a lot of change. As you drive across, the pressure is increasing, or increasing, that as you go across, it's decreasing. There's a lot of change in pressure. Interesting. Okay, so let's do our negatives now. So that was all pressures rising. Now let's look at the pressures dropping. So let's do the same thing. This time I'm going to use red, because red is where we have low pressure, where it's warm. 
So let's do our, hmm, we got our negative, let's start with negative 1. Well, negative 1 is going to have to go pretty close to that 0 there because look at that, set 5 again. And is 5 the highest over here? I think it is. So let's actually, maybe let's go backwards. Let's start 5. Then I see 4. Oh, this side has 4s. Okay, so 4 has to go between 3 and 5. 4, 4, 4. Uh oh. Now it's time for 3s. And there's a 2, so let's pretend the 3 kind of goes off this way. So 3, oh, pretty close. 3, 3, 3, 3, out to who knows where. Time for 2s. 2, 2, 2. Pretty close, oh my. And then the twos go out somewhere, fine. That's the two. And now the ones, oh, that's negative. That does make a difference. Negative one, the pressure dropped by one line right there, very close to zero, but not across the line. No. And actually, we can connect with that one with these other ones over here. One, 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 negative one. All right. So now we've had pressure dropping this one negative one out here in Florida. We're going to kind of say that that's part of something else. That's a negative one. It goes that way. But technically there would be a four, then three, then two, then one out here. So the weather, it depends on what else is going on in the system. And then threes and fives, it's going to be out that way too. So, wow. Look at that change right there. There is a lot of change going on. So I'm going to stop and do one last video that's going to show you what, how can we analyze that crazy thing there.